All right, we are back with Liliana Vasquez Hi. and Max, New York Handbags. How are you? Good, how are you? Wait, did you bring somebody to our IQDU party? I did. I brought my best friend, Melissa. Hi, she came, Melissa. This is Lisa. She Great came, to see you. Yeah, she came all the way from New York, and it was fitting because this is probably her favorite bag in the collection. There so you go. I had to have her. Well, I have to say that this bag has been um, getting a lot of attention mm. all night. Everybody who's seen it has said, oh my gosh, it's the coolest bag. Where'd you get it? <laughs> and it's actually coming up in the show. So Liliana is joining us with this great line, Max New York. This is a croc on boss Italian patent zip top bag. We have it in all four colors. We have it in this midnight blue. Gorgeous. That you're looking at right here. We also have it in the black. We have it in the cranberry. And we have it in the eggplant, which is yeah. a beautiful, beautiful purple on that one. And all four of these are gonna be your choice for $54 and change. It's amazing, it really is. And you know, purple has been the hottest color in fashion throughout the seasons, all of the jewel tones, really. But what I love about this one is if you go for the black, it's not your basic black. It's right. in our beautiful Italian Croco patent. So you're getting a lot of texture on the bag, which is what oh, kind of yeah. gives it a different shade of black. It's almost tonal. You know, you've got a little bit of gray mixed in, so it's not flat black. And you know what? Let's, let's have Melissa yeah. hold it. That's a really good Because look, idea. She's, she's wearing black. So if you're just saying, I'm going to be conservative right. and sit there and hold. Look at how great. Now, she's wearing all black, but the bag really pops. It goes with it her jewelry because it's not just a basic black bag. You're right. It looks fantastic. And it's so that's it's, a bag yeah. that really pops. It is. And you know what? I'm going to give her the purple one just because I love the idea of, you know, every woman has a basic black dress in their closet. You're right. in solid black now. So if you just, you know, pop it with a little bit of color, it just changes the whole look of what oh, yeah. she's wearing just by adding a little touch of color in your handbag. And I have to say, purple is the color of the season. <laughs> it is. It I totally mean, it, is. It, you know, it's true that, you know, black is back and purple is the new black. Yeah. I mean, I don't know, but purple <laughs> is just huge yeah. this year. So if you have anything in purple, you're going to be good. But what amazes me is $54 and 12 cents on an unbelievable bag with all the detail and this yeah. blue I have to say this midnight blue I think is so gorgeous it's very hard to find this color blue in a bag it is especially and we're actually, one that's not a cloth you know regular yeah cloth. exactly Look. this is the beautiful Italian pattern it's so easy to take care of which is I think why people like it because it gives you that very high-end luxury look oh, but yeah. it's so easy to take care of if anything oh. were to spill on it to, you know wipe it down with a damp cloth very quickly last call on the eggplant and the cranberry <laughs> last call on both of those and it has the two little pockets on either side in it front. does yeah I'd love to great take hardware. you through the back just so you can see you know you have two great pockets right here they're perfect for dropping the cell phone in it. On the back, we have a nice magnetic snap here. This is great. I mean, it's a big enough pocket to drop your wallet in. And then if you look inside, what I love is that this bag looks small, but at the same time, it definitely holds a lot. You have yes. a, lots of room. Again, we have that beautiful lining inside, that nice animal print, your Max signature logo plate, which I adore. And then the best thing about this bag is that it has a really nice shoulder drop. I know women are worried in the wintertime. Is it going to fit over my coat? Am right. I going to be able to wear it over a coat? And you definitely will with this bag. I think it's just a stunning oh, it's bag. it's gorgeous. And then, of course, again, in the back, you have that nice big. Yeah, you have tons of organization. I think that's what Max is really known for, is our ability to combine function with style. I mean, you're seeing this type of styling on a bag. is really what you're seeing on all the runways. It's what you're really seeing in all the fashion magazines. But right. at the same time, it's functional, and it works for a woman who needs you know a bag that can get her throughout her day I love the whole silhouette of it it's, a, it's an east-west bag you can fit a lot into it but it doesn't feel like a big bag no, not at all. all the top stitching all the details mm -hmm. all the hardware that max New York plate in the front is really really yeah. pretty that eggplant is completely sold out <laughs> so Melissa's gonna have to grab You're the cranberry to take that one Here, grab the you. cranberry Melissa that was yes. all gone I know and that looks I mean she's got gorgeous red hair so of course that looks actually beautiful. that cranberry is really great with what she's wearing because she does have red hair and then she's wearing black so the cranberry is really gonna pop and it's a beautiful beautiful deep cranberry right. that beautiful black or that gorgeous midnight blue but this is a bag that's a while supplies last price which means what we have is all we have when they're gone they're gone that's it so we're not coming back with them this grab is it. them they're gorgeous <laughs> and they're beautiful for this season Liliana thank you so much thank you for much. having me and happy holidays oh you too have a good one most <laughs> wonderful will. meeting you thank Thanks you so much coming. Lisa <laughs> okay and Rick Delmeyer standing by with more great ideas in the party where did Rick go